Hi, this is Brian with RedBand.com again, and I just wanted to do a quick video on the Apple Magic Mouse. This had replaced the Mighty Mouse, uh, and they had to change the name because they got in trouble for using it, I guess. But uh, the packaging comes in this little small container. It's uh, really cool, kind of cool how their uh, all their products Apple's releasing nowadays have really minimized the, the footprint is the new uh, term that they use for the environment whatever so anyways this is it it's pretty basic uh, it's got a really cool look to it L really good feel um, it's got a little button down here to turn it on and off it uses double a batteries and it comes with two double a batteries already installed you can also put rechargeable batteries in there they're saying the battery life or what I've been reading is about a month month and a half so that's great uh, Anyways, it connects through uh, Bluetooth, uh, and one of the coolest things about uh, the mouse is is that it's pretty much the whole screen of it is like a touch screen. It's kind of like an iPhone, where uh, it it doesn't have any buttons. Uh, you could do program it to do things with swipes, like you scroll by just going like this. Uh, you know, it does have a click to it. Uh, but if you want to right click, you can set it to, you know, to have two fingers and it will detect that you have two fingers uh, and will make it a right click. So you can pretty much program it how you want it. Now, Apple, when they give it to you in, in your preferences, you might have to update your software for it to, to work correctly. It's a free update, but whatever. Uh, they don't really include that much options, though, for adding a whole bunch of stuff. Luckily, there's a program called Magic Prefs. Uh, let me show you right here. Uh, and it is just a cluster of different things you can do. You can make it pretty much do anything you want. And uh, it, it, this is live, real time, uh, showing you how uh, the, the, the mouse sees your finger uh, anyways, but you can have it as an example if you want a two finger click you can change this to open up pretty much anything you want and if it doesn't have it listed here you can create your own thing so you could have it you know every time you hit the th three buttons on your mouse you can have it open up a program that you like or whatever I've uh, pretty much only added a few different ones uh, but as an example they have one where like every time I push the stem of the apple it uh, if I double click it it brings up a uh, spotlight you know to search things so I don't know if you can see that see it brought up spotlight uh, so you can pretty much program it to do whatever you want I have three fingers you know I just hit three fingers and it brings up you know how many windows I have open or displays I have open uh, I have pretty much set up just the basics right now I've been using it though it feels great in the hand and I just like the idea that the mouse has gotten to the point where it's so I don't know it's just great that you can now program a mouse to do exactly what you want and the more you get used to it you're gonna be able to just pretty much burn through the internet or programs or whatever you're doing anyways this is the apple magic mouse and i highly recommend it it's a little pricey but you're realizing you're not just getting a mouse you're getting something that you can program and set up to make it do exactly what you want to do uh this is brian with redband.com if you have any questions or anything let me know in the comments below and thank you for watching guys have a good day